have to update firmware of Radiolink RCAX. They are four steps in total. Step 1. Download the latest firmware on Radiolink official website. Here is Radiolink official website. Click RCAX. Firmware. The latest firmware is V1.1.0 and there are fixed packs and complete packs for it. So check carefully of their difference on this page and then download the suitable packs of the firmware. I choose the complete packs of V1.1.0. Click to download it. And the latest firmware has been downloaded to the desktop. Here it is. And the firmware is usually a zip file. You need to unzip it. After unzipping, there are some files in it, such as firmware font, icon, and so on. Step 2. Copy the firmware into SD card. There are two methods to copy the firmware into SD card using a card reader or a USB cable. I will copy the firmware with the USB cable. The SD card is in the card slot now. Here. Power off RCAX. Connect RCAX to the computer with the USB cable which comes with RCAX. Push DT1 and DT2 trim buttons to the middle. And long press the power button at the same time to enter the USB mode. Here are four buttons on this page. Turn DL1 code switch to select the function you want. And push PS3 buttons to return to the previous page. Press power button to confirm the selection. Now select USB mode and press power button to confirm it. Computer displays to remove a disk snap. RCAX external and RCAX internal. Copy all the files of the firmware to RCAX external. Copy. External. And paste. When it pops out the notes here, please choose Replace the files in the destination. And the firmware copy is complete. After the firmware copy is complete, press PS3 to return to the previous page. Step 3. Update the firmware. Turn GA1 to the second option. Update 
the latest and short press power button to confirm it. And the computer will recognize the latest firmware. It is V1.1.0. And do you want to confirm the upgrade? Press power button. And it shows update successfully. Then press PS3 to return to the previous page. And turn DL1 to power off. Then press power button to confirm it. So RCAX is powered off now. Step 4. Check firmware version RCAX. Then press power button to power it on. Click the icon to enter the system menu, username, and we can see the firmware is v1.1.0, which means the firmware update is complete and successful. So that's all about how to update the firmware of RSAX.